hello friends in this video lecture we are continuing the next point that is factors affecting solvent extraction there are some special reagents are used to increase or control the rate of solvent extraction now we are familiar with a normal solvent extraction process that is how it is carried out whenever a special type of compounds we have to extract like metals organic compounds biomolecules such as amides proteins lipids then these solutes are having moderate extracting capacity they are having very moderate extraction capacity and hence process requires addition of some of the special reagent so there are following some reagents which are used during the extraction process that is first one is the masking agent masking agent means what the name itself indicate that is masking means to mask to bind the specific solute with the help of these agents at this special situation all of us are familiar with a mask then what is the role of masking agent that is these are the chemical species which do not allow to extract unwanted metal ion with metal ion of interest right suppose we are taking a mixture of various metal ions some the अपन वेगवेगे मेटल आयन जर मिक्सर घपोज वी वॉन्ट टू एक्सट्रैक्ट ओनली टू टू थ्री प्रेसिस मेटल्स देन द रोल ऑफ मास्किंग एजेंट इज टू बाइंड ओनली द मेटल्स व्हिच इज टू बी एक्सट्रैक्टेड ऑफ आवर इंटरेस्ट अपाला जे मेटल एक्सट्रैक्ट कराए तो मेटल बराबर तो मास्किंग करल बॉन्डिंग करल एंड रेस्ट ऑफ द मेटल्स आर ऑलवेज केप्ड अनएक्सट्रैक्टेड राहले जे मेटल है तो कैसे थे तो अनएक्सट्रैक्टेड थे सो मास्किंग एजेंट्स वेन एवर यूज दीज आर द केमिकल स्पेसिज केमिकल कंपाउंड्स दैट इज पर्टिक्युलरली यूज for the process of extraction of metal which is our interest and which are the compounds are used as the extracting agent that is different types of tartarates that is salt of tartaric acid citrates salt of citric acid fluorides and edta ethylene diamine tetraacetate these are the four organic compounds which are used as a masking agents during the solvent extraction process which one that is tartarate citrate fluoride and edta ethylene diamine tetraacetate that is edta can be used as a masking agent fluoride can be used citrate and tartarate these are the four chemical species which can be used as a masking agent understand so masking agents are nothing but these are the special type of compounds chemical compounds which mask which bind the desired metal ions during the solvent extraction process in our interest and rest of the elements or metals are remain unextracted such agents are called as masking agent 
now remember the examples of masking agent that is masking agents are example that is tartarate citrate these are the salt of carboxylic acid fluorides and various types of edt ethylene diamine tetraacetate these are the particular chemical species which are used for the purpose of masking agents during the solvent extraction now second second these are the modifiers now modifiers are means what these are the substance which is to be added in a aqueous phase they increase during the solvent extraction we are using two phases that is one is the aqueous phase another one is the organic phase modifiers are the substances which are already dissolved in aqueous phase during the solvent extraction process due to addition of such type of modifier in aqueous phase they increase the solubility of solute to be extracted into organic solvent what is the role of modifier that is modifier increases the solubility of solute in the aqueous phase so that this solute is get easily extracted into organic solvent system and hence modifiers increase the rate of solvent extraction process understand again i will repeat but me repeat kar do modifiers are nothing but these are the substances which are previously already dissolved in aqueous phase they increase the solubility of solute which is to be extracted in organic solvent system tya solute ki solubility asha paddhatine they increase karta ki jyamule automatically tya particular solute chi ji extraction capacity ahe organic solvent madli ti kay hoil increase hoil okay now what are these modifiers modifiers are nothing but these are the higher molecular weight alcohols higher molecular weight alcohols that is heptanol octanol nonanol decanol such type of alcohols which are having large molecular weight no doubt alcohols are soluble in वॉटर वॉटर मध्य सग्या टाइप से अल्कोहल सोलिबल दोज अल्कोहल्स विच आर हेविंग हायर मॉलिकुलर वेट दीज अल्कोहल्स आर डिजॉल्ड इन स्पेसिफिक टाइप ऑफ एक्वियस फेज एंड सच टाइप ऑफ अल्कोहल्स आर यूज एज अ मॉलिकुलर अंडरस्टैंड द सो लार्ज मॉलिक्यू मॉलिकुलर वेट हेविंग अल्कोहल्स आर यूज एज अ modifier these are used as a modifier then third one that is the oxidation state now the oxidation state of that particular solute or metal ions during during the solvent extraction process is changed and this change in oxidation state large oxidation state is decreased to lower oxidation state means those metal which is to be extracted these metals are reduced by carrying out a redox reaction by suitable reagent oxidation state of metal ion can be changed that is oxidation state अपना का लगे चेंज करावे लगे एंड वेन एवर दिस ऑक्सीडेशन स्टेट इज चेंज मीन्स रिडॉक्शन रिडॉक्स रिएक्शन इज कैरिड आउट देन बाय चेंजिंग दिस ऑक्सीडेशन स्टेट वी कैन इंक्रीज द रेट ऑफ सॉल्वेंट एक्सट्रैक्शन प्रोसेस ना वॉट इज ऑक्सीडेशन स्टेट हाउ दिस फैक्टर अफेक्ट दैट इज विथ द हेल्प ऑफ दिस पर्टिक्युलर फैक्टर 
during the solvent extraction process of metal ion that is the oxidation state of that particular metal ion is reduced for this purpose the redox reaction is carried out understand again puna me repeat karto oxidation state sa solvent extraction chi kay role re whenever we are going to extract the metal ions from the mixture mixture madun metal ions jar aplyala extract karayche asti the such type of metal ions we have to reduce some the iron exist in majority two oxidation state that is fe3 plus and fe2 plus whenever we have to make the extraction of this metal ion iron then we have to reduce its oxidation state from fe3 plus to fe2 plus and this reduction decrease in oxidation state is carried out with the help of suitable reagent so this is the role of oxidation state is it right so these are the first three factors now next factor is the ph of the solution ph of the solution now ph affect the stability and charge on the metal complex is it right so during the solvent extraction what is what is ever the ph of that particular aqueous phase it affect the stability and charge on the metal complex aqueous phase madhe जो काय पर्टिक्युलर मेटल आयन असेल त्या मेटल आयनची स्टॅबिलिटी ही पी एचने काय झालेली असते इफेक्टिव्ह झालेली असते आणि चार्ज हा मेजॉरिटी त्या सोल्युशनच्या कशावरती डिपेंड असेल पी एचवरती डिपेंड असेल फॉर एक्झाम्पल द पी एच ॲट विच मेटल आयन कॉम्प्लेक्स इज मोस्ट स्टेबल ज्या पी एचला मेटल आयन कॉम्प्लेक्स हा सर्वात जास्त स्टेबल असेल at that condition the metal ions such type of ph is maintained is it right so during the solvent extraction ph should be maintained in such manner that at that ph range the metal ion is always stable to metal ion kay asla pahije stable asla pahije and न्यूट्रल इज द बेस्ट पी एच फॉर एक्सट्रैक्शन ऑफ मेटल आय कुछली पी एच ची रेंज है तो चौदह चौदह पी एच ची रेंज जर अल न्यूट्रल पी एच रेंज जर अल तो मेटल आयन्स इजीली एक्सट्रैक्ट होता मीन्स ड्यूरिंग सॉलवंट एक्सट्रैक्शन प्रोसेस ड्यूरिंग सॉलवंट एक्सट्रैक्शन प्रोसेस the ph of the system aqueous phase particularly is maintained at neutral range the nimi kutle range la thevlele asli pahije neutral range la thevlele asli pahije so this is the important factor that affect the solvent extraction process anje tachi ph chi range ti nimi kiti thevaychi tar neutral thevayche remember this point 14 this is the ph range by which we can maintain the ph of that particular solution then next point important point is the salting effect this is very easy sophisticated and low cost method to modify to increase the rate of solvent extraction that is salting effect the high concentration of salt sometimes help to extract metal ions from aqueous phase to organic phase okay those aqueous phase which contains higher concentration of salt and the aqueous phase mudhe kai salt kai karayche add karayche as the salts are added it helps to extract metal ions from aqueous phase to organic phase tela upyog kay hoto tar salt add kelyamule aqueous phase madhe asnare je kay metal ion asti te jasti jasti they moves towards organic phase and the rate of that particular solvent extraction goes on increasing 
त्याचा जो रेट आहे तो काय झालेला असेल इन्क्रीज झालेला असेल सो सॉल्ट इन्क्रीजेस व्हाय इट हॅपन्स सॉल्ट व्हेन एव्हर ॲडेड टू द ॲक्वेसफेस दे इन्क्रीज द आयनिक स्ट्रेंथ ऑफ ॲक्वेसफेस त्या पर्टिक्युलर ॲक्वेसफेसची आयनिक स्ट्रेंथ ते काय करतं इन्क्रीज करतं and thereby increase the solubility of metal complex into organic phase as the ionic strength goes on increasing hence these ions now get moved towards the solubility of metal complexes into organic phase and ji jas yas the solubility tya metal complex chi kuthe jate organic phase kade jate so what is the role of this salts that is whenever salts are added no doubt metals metal ions are get extracted from aqueous phase to organic phase second thing what is the role of this salt salt increases the ionic strength of aqueous phase the salt ki ionic strength ka hote increase hote and thereby increase the solubility of metal complex into organic phase tya metal complex ji ionic strength increase zalyamule solubility kasha madhe increase hote organic phase madhe so this is the factor affecting the solvent extraction process the next agents are synergic agents now what are the synergic agents that is these are the specific type of reagents which when added which when added to organic phase to organic phase it increases the efficiency of extraction they increase the efficiency of extraction remember that salts masking agents we are going to add in aqueous phase salt and masking agent हे नेहमी आपण कुठल्या फेजमध्ये ॲड करतो ॲक्वियस फेजमध्ये सिनर्जिक एजंट्स आर ॲडेड इन टू द ऑर्गेनिक फेज सो दॅट दे इन्क्रीज द इफिशियन्सी ऑफ एक्स्ट्रॅक्शन ऑर्गेनिक फेजमध्ये सिनर्जिक एजंट्स ॲड केल्यामुळे त्यांची जी इफिशियन्सी ती काय होते इन्क्रीज होते सेकंड थिंग दे गॉट असोसिएटेड विथ मेटल कॉम्प्लेक्स synergic agents what is the role of synergic agent that is synergic agents are get associated with metal complex and make it more soluble into organic phase these synergic agents are made more soluble in organic phase so what is the role of synergic agent that is synergic agent initially get associated with what organic solvent system organic solvent system and then they get associated with what metal ions hence metal ions and their solubility is increased association is increased in organic phase and automatically the rate of that particular phase increases by using synergic agents is it right so in this half lecture we have studied six different factors that is masking agents modifiers oxidation state ph salting effect and synergic agents these are the six factor which affect the rate of solvent extraction okay thank you